Hello guys, how's it going? Today I'm <coughs> back at my garage and I'm gonna be fixing the droopy tail lights on my CB650R. On my last video I installed the tail tidy, the fender eliminator, and uh, the tail lights didn't quite fit in there so I bought myself a saw. It's under there somewhere. And we're gonna try to cut those pieces shorter, make them shorter, and hopefully make it look not as droopy anymore, make it look better. So yeah, right now I'm just letting the garage warm up, put, turn on the heater. It's minus 30 here right now, but we have an electric space heater in the garage that just keeps going, I guess. I think it's about like minus two or minus three in there, so it's not too bad. Shouldn't take too long, we should have a nice warm garage. I'm just gonna wait a couple minutes and yeah, I guess start working on that. I did buy an air compressor to start my uh, power coating. So I might set that up as well today, but uh, we'll see. All right, I'm gonna try to make this as short as possible. It's gonna be just a very short video. Just gonna show you guys what I'm doing. Right now I'm gonna take out these tail lights, eight millimeter, and sorry if I'm gonna be talking fast. Still quite cold in here. One here, can't really keep up with that. I'm gonna take off these bolts. I'm just gonna take this whole thing off so I can have better access to those things is these wires right here are kind of covering up those bolts. So I'm just gonna take this off the take down the fork. And you know how better access to that. So I think I showed you guys before I'm gonna do it again. But this right here, uh, so I have to cut these shorter right here. So I gotta cut that in half and cut that in half. So it can go all the way in and hold it tight I guess because otherwise these just push push onto the light and there's a lot of space between that as this thing right here isn't as thick as the stock uh, fender was so gotta cut those and it should be good I think if I cut them in half that should be perfect all right I got this saw and I don't have a vice or anything so I'm gonna try to make this work with it on vice I don't know if the last clip filmed or not, but I haven't tightened it. I cut one in half. It took me like 20 minutes. It took way longer than I expected, but I haven't even tightened it yet, and it already looks way better. So about, before it was like really drooping, as I think you saw in this video. I think I filmed a clip of that, but in my previous video, you really saw it. You can see that, and this is a lot better right So I'm gonna just tighten it yet, and it should be a lot better. Yeah, that's definitely a lot better. I'll put sure if you can see it from there, I'll show you guys later. So that's gonna be for the other one, which is gonna take a while, but got this. Fucking cold on here. Like the rest of my body's pretty good, but my toes are really really cold. I'm just gonna try to quickly try and hammer this one out. I think I know how to do it more quickly now. Yeah. It's fucking cold in here. Got the second piece done. This didn't take nearly as long. This only took me like five, or like five minutes or something like that. Put that one on the other side yet. Alright, those are all there, so I'll start putting this thing back together. Put it back on the bike, I guess. The tail lights still don't seem quite right. I'm gonna try to adjust. See this one, I can turn a little bit. They almost seem tilted up too much, so I'm gonna try, try to just turn them and then tighten them. But that looks way better than it did before, that's for sure. All right, I'm just gonna finish that up and then I'll show you guys if it looks any different. All right, I think that's as straight as I, I'm gonna get them. They're not too bad, definitely a lot better than they were. I think in the future I might make something else here to make them even better, make more straight, and yeah, more even. This is a lot better already. 
can't quite see it as much as it's drooping. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. I'm not quite sure how long it's gonna be then. But uh, thanks for watching, subscribe, and Happy New Year. See ya.